The 1031 exchange is investment property for investment property, and it's tax deferred. The primary residence exemption is for a property that you have lived in for two out of the previous five years, and it is tax free. Where the confluence comes in is that Section 1031 is very clear that you cannot sell an investment property and purchase your primary residence. You must sell investment property and purchase property that it is your intent to hold for investment. So how do you demonstrate that intent? There's no statutory holding period, but there is a guarantee from the IRS with some conditions at two years. So somewhere around one to two years.